It is 645 right now, and this has to make you smile. Right now, two NASA astronauts who've been stranded in space for more than nine months are finally on their way home. Yeah, that SpaceX capsule undocked from the International Space Station overnight, carrying with it SUNY Williams and Butch Wilmore. Derek Waller has a story. All hooks open. All hooks are open. And undocking confirmed. Overnight, the moment two stranded American astronauts finally began their long delayed journey home. The SpaceX Dragon 9 capsule undocked from the International Space Station at 105 a.m. Eastern. Among the four person crew, Sonny Williams and Butch Wilmore. The pair embarked on a planned eight day research mission last June, but propulsion issues forced them to stay in orbit for more than nine months. The other two crew members on board, a Russian cosmonaut and another NASA astronaut. Ignition and lift off. Williams and Wilmore's replacement crew, led by Commander Ann McLean, launched Friday from the Kennedy Space Center. On Sunday, the veteran astronauts welcomed them aboard. It was a, a wonderful day. Great to see our friends arrive. You can hardly even put it into words. Uh, the ride up on the Falcon 9, uh, orbiting the Earth for the last couple of days, it's been absolutely incredible. Ken Bowersox, a former astronaut himself, now leads space operations for NASA. It's always a little bittersweet, uh, right? You miss your family, but you love being on space station. I'm looking forward to sitting across from them and hearing about uh, their perception of, of how things went and, and all about their time on orbit. And it will be a story unlike any other. And Splashdown is scheduled to happen just off the Florida coast tonight around 6 p.m. Eastern. I'm Derek Waller, CBS News. And Paul, you brought up a really interesting point, too. Mm -hmm. the, the fact that they lose so much muscle mass mm -hmm. being weightless for that long, it's, it's going to be, uh, they're going to take some PT to get back in shape. Yeah, mm -hmm. They say about 50% right. of muscle mass. So, yeah, so things get kind of difficult if you lose that much, you know. Hey,